What is up, guys? It's your boy Shampoo. Welcome to episode three of FTS Podcast. I'm with Chris and Ed. Yeah. Ed and Chris. Let's get started. Yeah. Alright, so before we start this podcast, episode three, um, I want you guys to comment down below what you guys think of the second podcast. How do you guys think it went? I feel like it went real good. I mean, we gave out some good details, some good tips and stuff. Some advice, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we gave out everything we, we had at the moment. It, it went good. It went mucho bueno. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, you guys gotta let us know how you guys feel about uh, uh, episodes and stuff, and I don't know. Really fast. So uh-huh. We're gonna keep it moving. Make sure y'all uh-huh. comment down below. Show yeah, me y'all what y'all Twitter fingers look like. You know, uh-huh. all that. All right. Hey, don't turn that into No. Ooh. All right. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, the first thing I want to talk about is high fashion versus fashion. How it's completely different. Yeah, I mean, it's a big, it's a big gap. Because okay. when I think of high fashion, I think of the city shirts that uh, yes, were designed the other day. And like the, other day. <laughs> the people in the runway, you don't see people outside wearing what people wore in the runway. Well, actually, I feel like people do wear those clothes. It's just that we don't see. Yeah, them. that is true. Because also where we live at. You yeah, know, if if you go to New York or like really popular cities, then you'll see that. That's 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 exactly what it is. It's just where we live at. But, that's why yeah. people don't. But another thing is, sorry, did you cut me off? That's oh, sorry, you got, you got, you got, you got But I see, <laughs> another thing is that we don't see them on because we don't even see them in pictures true. on the street, true. Mm-hmm. even if we don't live in those big cities. Yeah, because I feel like those type of people that do wear the high fashion stuff, they're not too big on like, oh, I'm, I'm gonna take a picture and then post it. They're not going to Walmart. Exactly. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, they're not going to rush her around. Louis Vuitton fit on. Um, yeah, yeah. On head sure. Oh, snap. I mean, yeah, for sure, for sure. But okay, um, moving along to the next topic real quick. Um, Nike, I don't think they released it yet, but they're gonna release the Nike hands-free shoes. I personally like them because it's like, you don't even have to use your hands, you just stick your foot in there, keep it moving, take it out and just, no hand. This is my thing. I got a hands-free shoe. The slides that I wear on a daily basis. Those are slides, not shoes though. I'm but, talking about shoes. But I don't wanna wear no hands-free shoes. I just feel like if I'm wearing... When I get them, don't say nothing to me. You got it. Uh, right. yeah. okay. Hey, that's your droop, big homie. Okay. But my thing is, if I'm wearing some hands-free shoes, just give me my slides. Like, why, why I'm See, doing all that? See, here's the thing, though. Well, I just get some you're catches. Co- you're comparing... Oh. <laughs> hey, no. give me, give me that deal, Steph. Just go back to what you were saying. I'm, compa- <laughs> I'm talking about slides and shoes. I get the whole slides thing, but I'm talking about shoes. But if I'm putting on, I just, I don't know. It's like, if I'm putting on the shoe shoes, itself, it's, like, it's like a running type of shoe. You feel me? You can't run and slide. I, 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 I want think, you to run it now. I don't think it's, I was just about to I say, want you to I run it now. No. Like, <laughs> I don't nah. think Nike released it as a running shoe, you know, quote unquote running shoe, because they released a lot of running shoes, basketball shoes. Yeah. You but running them shoes. First of all, the shoe opens up. And it so closes. How you gonna run? It's open. <laughs> yeah, but it opens it open in the back door. I Unless like, you like clumsy and like you step on your own shoe and like your shoe comes off. Oh, That's I feel like it's a drop for me. And speaking of, <laughs> this is not a couple drop. <laughs> yeah. But this is the thing though. I feel like it's a two go shoe. Yeah. Like, oh, I gotta go. Boom. But I get your point. You need to split up the slot. But that, like, that's, a, people, that's, that's a shoe you wear when your mom pull up with the groceries. Exactly. Yeah, 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 yeah. exactly. But, but I will wear my slides. I know. The slides that don't fit you. Yeah. Your feet too big. The, the slides, slides too small. Any shoe that you can get your foot in. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> you see? Oh, another thing. This is Nike. Extra. Nike sells 25 pairs of shoes a second. That is crazy. Bro. 25? That, Oh, 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 I, gotta, I, I gotta get count for Nike, I'm sorry. But like compared to like Adidas, what they sell like, they sell like what, 13? I think so, yeah. 13 uh, a second? Yeah. That's a big difference. That's a gap. Look, but, look at the gap in there. But I'm saying though, everybody, well, most of the people are more Nike than Adidas. Yeah. And yeah. I feel like that's what they're Checks over stripes. Checks over stripes. That's why I feel like they're on top of the, on the, on the suits of the line. Yeah. Because. Yeah. I mean, everybody gets Nike this nigga. Everybody knows Nike. I mean, right. most of the people know what it is, but it ain't like, they don't have like that much of a uh, impact on people. I feel like Nike has like better marketing strategies than Adidas. Cause like you see yeah. more like Nike advertisements than Adidas. 
True. That's that's very true. That's a good point. I don't even know what to do. I ain't, I ain't even think about that. Hey, where you, where you from? I I took part, I took marketing in college, so. <laughs> yeah. that's, a good, that's a good point. But yeah, that's true. Like aside, like how would you know that it is dropping a shoe if they don't have advertising? Yeah, advertising. But another thing that I think I did is doing wrong is that they don't have enough people on there. Like on the team. Nike got people. See, Nike got NBA players. They yeah. got rappers. They got. I don't know, people that was doing that, skateboarders. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? I mean, it doesn't look that I need a skateboard like mm-hmm. Nike does. Yeah, and on no, top of well, that, how would that look like though? If it that's that's, like that's what I'm saying. Like that's what I was just about to say. Like it's the look of the shoes yeah. too. Like I think that's that's another reason why like Nike's so superior, bro. Look look how the shoes look. True. Like they like Nike has so many shoes. Pete, look at the dunks. What ears and zombies? What? Zombie. What, <laughs> what what shoe do a deal have that? It's like. I mean, I, I mean, the Yeezy is one of their best shoes. Yeah, but for the past what, like five years? Yeah, and, and but and Dunks, have. Dunks just made a return, and it's like so they've been there. Do you think Yeezys are gonna make a return like that nah, in twenty years? Exactly. I don't, I don't think so, cause they already died now. True. Okay. And they've been there for five years. So yeah. now that we're on the topic of shoes, what's a shoe that you regret buying? I want to start first. The Phoenix. Okay. Yeah. I'm glad you knocked that out. I'm glad you knocked that out. I want to go ahead and get that out of there. I'm about the Phoenix. Nah. Yeah. I'm still tripping over the fact that you thought that was. Bro, that was was episode one. Let it go. Nah, I can't. I'm stuck. That was Mr. Phoenix. No, no, no. No. Who who is that? Phoenix. But a shoe I regret buying is the Blazers. Honestly, I just I haven't worn them. I try to. Hop on the train, oh yeah, so basically get with some little roll jeans and everything. Yeah. But I'm just too tall for that motherfucker. This is gonna do my like high water. True. To, on me. But that's why I'm like, I just can't, I just can't feel them right. I mean, it's, when I put them on, I feel like it's an Air Jordan 1. Yeah. But on the look, I know it's not. It's not the same. Like, yeah. I, I'm not comparing it with like the feelers in the, in the Air Force. Yeah. Not, so I'm substituting the places for the Jordan 1. Like, yeah. Be, but, um, <laughs> <laughs> but, okay. Shots fired. But I just, I just can't find myself to wear with the right outfit. Yeah. That I feel comfortable with. What's your deal with So you know how we talk about the twos, right? Yeah. I had a pair when I was a youngin, and like I knew then that that shoe wasn't it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like I mean, you like have yeah, nah, okay. nah, that shoe ain't it, bro. Like <laughs> I don't know what I don't know what I was thinking. Like of course I didn't buy it, but you know I had it. And I, I, I regret my mom by it. You know what I'm saying? We got to talk to mom, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I would say, do you do you guys think so? What, was it the three that kept Jordan in Nike? It was the three, right? Yeah. So do you guys think that the two was the one that kind of like made them look at other brands? Like, do you think the two had an impact in that or no? Possibly. Mm, yeah, maybe. But you got to think about all the shoes you have. You know what I'm saying? I know I'm saying, but like I'm talking about like 80, 86, whenever okay. the two came out. Like yeah. the two was out. They didn't know what the three looked like. Jordan wanted to leave at that point. Mm-hmm. Right. And that's when Tinker came through and he was like, well, I got these but And then he just shot them on or whatever. I, I read about it and and Jordan just stayed with him. Yeah. Because, the, because of the Jordan three. Imagine if Jordan would have went to a theater. Bro, that's what I was about to say. Cause what like would we still have like an eleven or like a six or a four or five. No, nah, we definitely would have. We, we definitely would have had like, yeah, but like numbers and shoes. You know what I'm saying? Like consecutive sure. shoes coming out all the time. But That's what they would have looked like is yeah, the question. I don't think. I, I, I don't think that it would have been like like how Jordan is his own brand. It's Nike and Jordan. Right. Like Jordan is his own brand. I don't think it would be Adidas and Jordan. I think it was just. Jordan mm-hmm. would be with Adidas. Adidas. Yeah, yeah, he yeah. wouldn't have his own brand. Like Steph Curry got uh, with uh, Steph, with Under Armour. He just got yeah. that brand. I don't think that would have happened with Jordan if he would have went somewhere else. Low key, a shoe that I do regret buying, like besides the Fila, is mm-hmm. the Cool Gray Eleven Lows. Wow, I, that's a classic shoe. Though. It is, but like I don't well, know, not the low. Well, the low, the colorway, the colorway. Exactly. Like, I know. I, like I know it. it's two different materials, like on the on that shoe. Yeah. Is that why? No, I, I I just don't feel like I can rock it though. It's kind of like how I feel about the Blazers. That's how he feels. Uh, I have I have the Blazers. Okay, okay. That's the all white with the blue uh swoosh. swoosh. Mm-hmm. But like, I would rather wear those before the cool gray eleven. Gotcha. Yeah, yeah. Gotcha. But like, what's I mean, I don't know. I, I don't know how I feel about that. But what's the shoe you guys been rocking lately? Like on your rotation? Um, 
Air Forces, Slide. I rock Air Forces. Yeah. I don't really rock Slides too much, yeah. bro. I don't like my Air Force ones. I don't really wear them. Oh, oh yeah. I got, I got, I got you just have to walk around the house in socks, huh? <laughs> oh, the white socks do look like I got that right now. You got some big custom? No, nah, I'm wrong. You got like custom on us. So, y'all need some custom? Hit the video. Everything, y'all need these in Air Force One? Oh, we got I got you. I got you. <laughs> right, for real. Nah, but um, Air Force Ones, uh, the Off White Zooms, yeah. and besides, I, I, let me see. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Because I have the Jordan One Royals, but like I haven't really worn those a lot. Mm. So I feel like the other shoe that would be like, yeah, it's, it's my rotation. It'll probably be the um, Alternate Force. Yeah, I mean it's a it's a calm color. It's just white and red. White and red. I mean, yeah. you just rock with it. I mean, anything you do, I mean, you can throw on red with a blue shirt on. True. Don't do that, but I'm saying <laughs> that just, you would. <laughs> what I'm saying is that that's just a shoe that you can't just, like, let's go and get yeah. moving. That right. ain't like a shoe that you're going to keep out the door. True. True. But and it's also not a shoe that's just like, oh, like, he just doing too much. Like, it's just like, it's, it's, like, like, it's, it's, it's like, like white and red. It's white and red. Know? Well, me, on the other hand, the shoe doesn't my rotation. It ain't, like, really my rotation, but it's a shoe that I'm just like, hmm, what am I going to wear with all black? Like, I always wear it. The Travis's. I just throw them all, that's it. You just, I just go. And you gonna beat them up or you gonna wait till you get a second pair? They are really beat a little bit. Oh! <laughs> that really beat up, beat up. I mean, they yeah. real good. But I feel like I'm, I'm kind of going hard on them because I don't really don't care. Yeah. I mean, I do care. Oh, he got money. Oh my God, he got yeah. money? <laughs> nah. I don't got money, but it's like, I'm just, it's a shoe, shoes are meant to be worn. Yeah. So that's in my opinion. True, true. But that's just a shoe that I just like, keep it going, let's go. Yeah. Not, I'm not worn, worn, not shoe. beat. Worn, not beat. Yeah, don't beat your shoes. <laughs> don't beat your shoes, though. Man. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Uh, okay, so I'm a I'm a big I'm big on like calm dripping, you know, comfortable when you're dripping or whatever. So uh, I'm gonna have to go with my reacts. My boy hooked me up with them. You know, he said to me, hit me up. He was like, you know, they got these reacts, whatever. And yeah, that's 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 one of my shoes in my rotation. I'm gonna have to say the uh, I got the. Uh, 11 lows, the Easter, the colorway. Yeah, uh, a lot of people don't have them. I, I don't know why I got them. I, I like the shoes. I like how it look or whatever. Uh, that's in my rotation. And then I'm gonna have to go, I'm gonna have to go with, uh, I don't know. I feel like it's it's a, it's a Jordan 1, but which one? Nah. I feel like with Andrew and 1, you can't go wrong. Yeah, I feel like it'll be it'll be well, a Jordan high, one too. Yeah, the highs. Yeah, yeah. I don't have any of those basically. So. Or mids. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. It, it's definitely my Chicago mids. Definitely. Oh, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> which one you got? The one with the with the white back or with the red with the black front? I got both of them. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. And speaking of the reacts and the zoom by, like I say, I feel yeah. like that's a shoe that you can keep by the door. Cause that's just a shoe that you yeah. let's go. You just throw on, you know. I mean, not the all white. Uh, Zoom lines, yeah. but like I was just gonna say the off-white reacts. I was like, who made them? Who made them? Right now, right now, right now, yeah. But I'm just saying, like, that's a shoe that, that you can use in a slide. Yeah. Don't step on the back of the heel, though. Yeah. Like, don't do that. Y'all be wildin'. Y'all be wildin'. Put the shoe on and, and keep it moving. Y'all be wildin'. You can't beat those up. Don't step on the back of your shoe. Man, for real. That's childish, bro. That's childish. Okay, so. Man, that's childish. Man, that's childish. Man, that's childish. Okay, so <laughs> moving along, I want to talk about SBs, how like it's become a trend. And like, do you think it'll die off in a couple of years or like still gonna go strong? Okay. Oh, sorry. You good, yeah. So, I, I feel like it's back and it's back to stay. You think so? Yeah, it's because. You, wait, you don't think so? No, 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 that's what I was thinking. Right. I don't think I'm so. I'm with you. I'm with you. I'm nah, with you. You, you don't it's think so? It's gonna stay for a minute, but it ain't gonna be like forever. Okay, well, yeah, I get that because like stuff, uh, a lot of stuff died down and, and repeated. And fashion stuff. repeats itself. That's just how, that's how history is, you yeah. know what I'm saying? So, of course, it's gonna be like that with fashion and, and kicks and everything like that. Yeah. But, I mean, like, I definitely feel like it's gonna be here longer than it was last time. True. How long was it even last time? Like, three years? Like, yeah. Like, even like five, eight years? It was like five to eight. Five to eight. Like, when did it like release? Like SB has come about. Really? Like oh, so five oh seven? That's when uh, SB's released. Oh, way before that. Well, SB's it was like the nineties. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The H boy, the SB's like, skateboard uh, yeah. part of the SB. 
But the dunk itself, yeah, dunk. which is the one that's popping now, been out since the 80s. Yeah. That was like 90s. They, they, they had the highs first. Yeah, they had the highs. Yeah, they had the highs first. The pack and all that. So you, feel like like be, so, you, so you feel that it'll be a thing if they keep collaborating and kind of coming out. Exactly. With that. And that's why I was saying that because like, Nowadays, collaborations are huge. True. So, like, I feel like Nike know that. You know what I'm saying? Nike's smart. So, like, as as far as like get them keep getting collaborations, that's gonna make that way stay around because who people else like this. Who's gonna collaborate with though? I mean, because they've they, they, they they already, they already done Travis. I feel like you, know, you can do it. Yeah, you, you, you can do it though. Think about that. Now, that's tough. Yeah, you can do it. Undefeated can do it. Though. Undefeated can do it. Who else? Uh. Well, we don't the need trophy, uh, the trophy room people. Yes. They can do a dunk. Yeah. yeah, we don't need a supreme dunk. We have it already, but like I just feel like that's just like you just no. Just we don't need another supreme dunk. I feel like the, the colorways that we have already that's good enough. Yeah, they, they, they can, can, they can definitely OD if they keep on touring. Yeah, of course, <laughs> of course, of course, yeah. Like, but another thing I was gonna say that how you said that Nike knows what they're doing. Yeah, something that happens with Adidas going back to that topic that we're right. having here that they do almost every time is that. The NMDs when they came out, mm -hmm. it was on top of the list. Yeah. Right. The Ultra Boost when they came out, top of the list. Mm -hmm. Yeezys when they came out, Jump Over Jumping song and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But then what did they do? They just released Colorway after Colorway after Colorway. And the thing color, is, the two point the three point zero, and then the colorways look the same. Yeah, months separate. That's on the Yeezy side though, but on the NMDs and the Ultra Boost. It was just like little differences here and there. Yeah. And it was a 2.0, 3.0, 5.0, 7.0. And it was just one after the other. They could have done it a little bit different. And that's why you died out. But if they do it right with the dunks, it's gonna stay here for a minute. Yeah, because a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff saved them like them them okay. certain sneakers, like Kanye with the Ultra Boots, of course. Of course, yeah. That, that made the hype go up. Then Pharrell had his NMDs, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like that saved them. Okay. But yeah. like you wildin' if you keep on doing the oh, same thing. Oh, yeah. yeah. You don't get tired of seeing it. Exactly. No, people can't get all the shoes. Yeah, that's, that's what that's it is. The thing. People, you may like all the shoes in the world, but you can't get them. Yeah, true. I mean, you you could, but not okay. everybody can. But, but like, even like dunks, they hard to get. But look what they priced at. A hundred dollars. That's a real affordable shoe. You know what I'm saying? What yeah. What's the retail for like um NMDs or Ultra Boost? I think it was one Ultra Boost a one eighty. I think it was a one time or a 220. I really can't remember. Compared to uh, dunks. Compared to 100 dollars But another thing I like about Nike is that they, they brought out the years, like the shoes in the past. Yeah. Like these came out in the past and those came out before in the yeah. Ugly Duckling pack. Yeah. Back in 2001, 2002, I think it was. Right. So they just bringing them back. And that's yeah. a good thing. If they don't OD in them colorways, they'll be all right. Trump. That's. I couldn't agree more, man. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so another thing that I want to talk about is Space Jam 2. Boom, hey. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to think of Michael. Sorry, I'm not going to do it. LeBron James going to switch on. What's that thing? What happened? I started to watch Space Jam 1. What? Dude, where is it? Who are you? Yeah, I think it's bad. He lives on the rock. Who's yeah, man? I haven't watched Space Jam. Exactly. I mean, like, I probably watched that like, as a little kid. I like, watched clips here and there, but like, I've never like sat down and was like, yeah, I'm watching. Are you? I are you against it? it? I'll watch it. No, I want to watch it, though, but I'm just saying I haven't watched it yet. For episode four, he's gonna go binge it. Space Jam. Yeah. But I, I, well, not I feel like, but I watched it when I was young. But then when I grew older and I, I had an open mind, mm -hmm. I was like, I gotta watch the movie to see what it's about. Cause mm -hmm. I didn't know what it was about. It was just some cartoons and Michael Jordan. Yeah. Who was Michael Jordan? And, and when R. I was Kelly. Two years old. Yeah, yeah sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Who was Michael Jordan when I was four years old? I don't know. Yeah. Michael Jordan was done to me when I was four. But I just I don't know how I feel about it because it's like. That's that's Jordan thing. Yeah. I know I, I watched the interview about LeBron saying like it's not a sequel. You know what I'm saying? It's more like his own thing about yeah. him being LeBron and his greatness. But I just feel like if you was gonna make a movie, make something else. Like it's yeah. what is Space Jam? Why he's changed the name? Yeah, so I not. feel like it's just Space Jam second coming. Like, exactly, because like, it's really Space Jam too. Exactly. Exactly, because when you talk about Space Jam, you think of Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan. That's so when you, bring, when you say it. Space Jam 2, and it's LeBron and not Michael, you're just like, hold on, I, I wanted Michael. Yeah. Who is he? <laughs> who, is, yo, who man is this? We're not, <laughs> we not knocking, I'm not knocking LeBron. Great I'm great. not, well, but I'm, I'm just saying. It like, would have been better if they, if they would have kept Jordan. Yeah. But hopefully Jordan is in the movie. They could have called it LeBron the movie or yeah. something like that. Yeah, I mean, LeBron movie? <laughs> that would have been, I wouldn't even clicked on it. <laughs> See it on Netflix, I ain't watching it. 
Cartoons and LeBron. I ain't watching that. LeBron cartoons. LeBron cartoons. There you go. I'm good on that. Next. Okay, so another thing. <laughs> another thing that I want to talk about is like how people when they uh, when shoes come out and they get it, they're like, oh, it's gonna be like this. Oh, it's gonna be like this. Like 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 oh, it's gonna be like this. I get like Virgil. Virgil do a lot of deconstructing issues. That's Virgil. That's what I'm saying. Virgil's doing his thing. I feel like that is disrespectful. But okay. to, to the OG shoe and to what Virgil did exactly. to, to create his own shoe. But that's what that's this is another thing. Virgil has always not said, but like I always supported that make your own shoe. Cause really, yeah. like any of the off white, you can literally get a regular shoe. Let me simple. Like you can literally get a regular shoe and make it. Yeah. And like they they, did the they cut the tongue out the shoe. But I feel like if you ask Virgil, how do you feel about this? Yes, I love it. Because remember when the fires came out, the black ones, uh -huh. right? Did we cut the holes out of them? Yeah. Right. I mean, he didn't cut the hole. Exactly. Top, but he he made like, it into a low top. Like, yeah, he I made know, it. But I feel like top. Virgil this man himself, cut the tongue off <laughs> the shoe. Like, but I feel like Virgil would support that. Yeah, that's my opinion. I don't support people, it at all. People do that for attention also. Yeah, definitely. For definitely. sure. They're not They're like, look, I got the iPhone 5, you don't. I'm going to make you mad and cut it. That makes me tired. And it works. Yeah. Right. And it works. Yeah. But I feel like some of them might be fakes. They might have like two pairs, one a real pair, one a fake pair. Like, you know, I'm not and it's strictly for attention. Yeah. I mean, I get that too, uh, yeah, but it's just, it gotta be a few it's just the fact that they're yeah, doing it, bro. Like, 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 you tripping, man. Like, what's up? Like, what is you, what is exactly. You? Are you good at home, bro? Like, what's going on? Let, like, let me get them. talk about it. Let, let, let me get them. I feel like the person that designed that shoe, they did enough. Like, you, exactly. don't, you don't have to do all that. Okay, so here's the thing. Here's the question I have. Mm -hmm. How you said, like, that the shoe, like, the person that designed the shoe made, made enough of it. How do you feel about like people grabbing the sharpie and drawing like the air Chris? That's cool. You know how Virgil was signing his shoes? See, that's not OD. You're not cutting it. But that's what I'm saying. That's still doing more than than the no, no bro. Adding you you cutting cut. the shoe <laughs> versus I'm just saying it's just a question. Versus so writing on it. Come on, come bro. On, a little come, little on, little come on, man. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Don't, don't cut the shoe, man. <laughs> no. Don't cut the shoe. Let the shoe, let, just let the shoe be. Bro. Don't cut the shoe straight, man. <laughs> but okay, so that's, that's, another thing that I want to uh, talk about, you know, moving on a little forward, phone posits and lookalikes. And by that, I don't mean like fake phone posits. I mean like you have like the regular like phone posits, and then you have the uh, Comedy Got a Song phone posits. Mm -hmm. And then you have the uh, Louis Vuitton one. Louis Vuitton. Yeah, the, the, the version made. Yeah. Was, well, actually, actually, the the Comte de Gassan one wear Nike. Yeah, so it, it was wearing looking like. Yeah. That's a that's a whole other. Uh, that's a different. That's a collab. Right. Yeah, that's a collab. Yeah, that's a collab. But the Louis, even though it's not the same form as the phone posit, mm -hmm. it has like the shell, the little plasticky shell. Yeah, and the, uh, and they also have the one that looks like the Jordan Four. I don't know what those are called. Yeah, I think they're like the 17 uh, Yeah, I know it's I, I know it's some hundred, but they yeah. also look like the Jordan 4s. I feel like, like colorway. with a shoe like that, not the phone pass, but like the Louis Vuitton, it's just like, why? You, you're just trying too hard. I mean, you know Louis Vuitton, I'm not going to jack Louis Vuitton. In my opinion, I, I that was the only part that I've seen that was phone positive like was like the, the shell. Side. Side. The yeah. shell. Yeah. yeah, but I mean, like other than that, I didn't feel like, because... This this is my thing. If you feel like they did too much, Nike would have felt the same way, and they would have got sued. Nice. Exactly, because you know you already you already know yeah, Nike go get the shoe isn't the same shape. It's shape. It's not the same. Like, it's not a phone pop. It's not like the base was in the Air Force. Exactly. It's not like okay. that. It's just but like, like the little things. Like everybody wants a phone exactly. pop. It's a phone pop. But I don't like them though. Not because they're Louis, but I, I I don't like personally I don't like them. It's because they're Louis. It's because they're Louis. It's because they're Louis. <laughs> <laughs> I, ain't, I, ain't, I ain't got no Louis in my uh Shoot. in my inventory. <laughs> that we know of. Like, It'd yeah, be I'm holding out, you feel me? Oh. But I'm saying though, like, I don't know. I don't like phone posits. I don't either. Hey, but bad bulky like the like his feelers. But anyways. And the Jordan Eights. <laughs> yeah, got the Jordan Eights, but I'm saying the Jordan Eights are yeah, Jordan big man shoes. Yeah. Okay. So, and moving, 13, on, and 13, moving on to the next topic, you know, we're going to talk about the best and the worst Jordans, so let's get on to that right now. Okay, so I feel like the best Jordans the top. is mm -hmm. the Jordan 1. 
pop. Not because like everybody made it popular, mm-hmm. but because like I feel like it's just a, it's just a good shoe overall. Yeah. Jordan One and Jordan Four. But since I'm gonna talk about one, I'm talking, mm-hmm. I'm gonna talk about the Jordan One. All right, words from hit me with And so, obviously the Chicago's. That's like everybody knows about that. Mm-hmm. But like I feel like a shoe or the uh, the colorway that nobody really talks about as much is the um, the core purple. The OG shattered backboard. I don't know about, I don't know what happened with the 3.0s. The um yeah. what's it called? The unions. I thought it was 3.0s. Straight to the, trash. The, uh, the glass shatter and then they taped it up. Okay. I talked to Jordan about it. <laughs> <laughs> Talk to Jordan. But I, I just like I just like the best shoe, the best Jordan is the Jordan 1. The I worst was, would I, probably have to be the eights. Eights are freaking horrible, bro. Eights are kind of bad. Eights are kind of bad. The aquas is like, you know, we pick up eights aquas, and I like it, but like. I like the shoe itself. <laughs> that that was, shoe is terrible. The shoe is terrible. And that was fair. I would the rather. Shoe? I would rather. Over there? Over there? I respect it over there? Yeah, from a distance. But. You can eat. For me? There's not that much table. Exactly. Okay. You better mm-hmm. go this day? Mm-hmm. I would wear, yeah. I would wear <laughs> two before the eights. Believe that, man. Okay. Give, me the, give me the metal two. I'm positive. Okay. Give me the down seas two. Hype beast. Yeah. First of all. Yeah. Second of all, hype beast and third of all, what would you say? Hype beast. Hype beast. Yes, yeah. sir. <laughs> What's your best and worst Jordan? Uh, best Jordan? Give me, give me the Concords, you know? Come on, 11? Yeah, 11. Yeah, for sure. I agree with that. Um, he going to say the 15. How's it look? Yeah, OG, man. Come on, Big OG. Come on, y'all know, y'all know the vibes. Y'all seen episode one? Look, he talking about you remember from the first episode. Yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, but anyways, oh, what's yeah. Up, what's up, man? But uh, yeah, the uh, the Elevens for sure. Um, the worst Jordan. I, I, you gonna say eight? No, I said eight. Don't say eight. No, I'm not gonna say eight. Wait, wait, wait. I was wait. I'm not. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna keep it between one and fourteen. I'm finna That's exceed. I'm finna, to I'm finna. exceed that because that personally, ask. personally, what, I, what is it? The uh, what, was it? Is it seventeen with the little plate on top? Yeah. Like once you pass twelve, in my opinion, no. Twelve? You don't rock with fourteen? Oh, 14. Well, 13, 14, though. No, no, 14 is like tough. That. Like, 13 is oh, yeah, okay. The only 14s oh, I like, like is the. Right, so Ferrari 14s. That's the only 14 that I like. Bro. Oh, the new one, the old red one? Ooh. The Ferrari 14s. <laughs> Ooh, nasty with the old red one. But yeah, the one with the plate on it, bro, I just feel like that looks terrible. Like I heard, that's a comfortable shoe. You know, I seen I'll say it look complex. Uh, oh yeah, was, uh, yeah. Like, he he cool. rocked with them. Yeah, rock but with I feel like that that shoe is terrible. Like I, I, I don't know. I might get a pair just to hoop in. I'm gonna try it out. It might be comfortable. I mean, Jordan was at a higher age, so it might be comfortable. Yeah. What he did, what he did, what he did. But what you what you what you thinking? What I, he did, what he did, what he did. Yeah, my favorite Jordan is the Jordan Four. So, so in my opinion, I think that's the best Jordan. I was gonna say that. Okay. The Jordan Four is my favorite Jordan. I mean. It's just a, a nice wise collaboration. Yeah. Wise. It's up there on my list for sure. Yeah, definitely top two. And then and then not two. Mine. It's yeah, not two. two. Yeah. Yeah. It might be two. PSGs, you got you the know? unions, you got off whites. You got a whole bunch. I mean, I'm talking about the, yeah, Bro, the you're high beast. Exactly. He's all the high beast. PSG. I don't know. Okay, hold on. Let me go ahead and like knock that out. Okay, let's hear Uh, You got the off whites. Oh! You got the off whites. No. You got the. You got the linens, those are fire. Okay. You, got, okay. you got the mushrooms, they even, you know, the women's release, but like they're still fire. Okay. You got the pure money, because you know, okay. fire red fours. You got the. Uh, okay, bro, we get it, bro. You know, bro, we get, you, know you, you made the cut. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> but yeah, that's that's one of my favorite. Uh, but the uh, shoe out of well, the Jordan, I, I think is one of the worst. You're going to hate me for this. It's the one with the strap. The one that, uh, the one that you can take off the strap. I think oh. Melo used to wear them all the time. Yeah, I don't know yeah, what numbers they are, but they passed the 14. I know you like it because we talked about it before. But uh, they have a strap that goes through, and they, the strap got like a little Jordan gem in the in the in the. Silver. I'm really having a brain fart right now. I can't I'm remember. Sure, I, sure, I forgot. I don't know. I, 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 I know we talked about this, but I cannot remember that shoe. But we gonna put a picture on top. Ah, yeah. that's that's gonna bother me. We're gonna put a picture. You are gonna watch the video and you are gonna be like, oh yeah. You you gotta comment. <laughs> yeah. You gotta comment. Okay? Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna yeah. make sure y'all comment. Hey, y'all y'all follow my lead. I'm gonna comment and y'all do the same thing. They're, wow, like the training, eh? 
Do what? <laughs> what is it? Yeah. Just follow him. Make sure y'all come in. That's what y'all do. Yeah. For sure. Okay, so I want to talk about the top five slept on brands. I don't mean like high beast wise. I just mean like Supreme so slept on. Oh my gosh. Who's man? But like we talking, we talking like fashion or just anything in general. Any, like any slept on brand. Well, I feel like Chinatown Market. It's not as um, hype or like as up there. As it should be, in your opinion. Okay, I can see that. Yeah, basically, you're saying like they, they deserve their respect. Yeah, Chinatown yeah. Market deserves their respect. Yeah. Go ahead, Chris, say it. I was talking, we was talking about I, it. I was talking about this the other day. But like I get like some like some of their designs, I get like mad childish vibes from it. Like kind of childish, like Chinatown kind of Market. Yeah. yeah, that's cool. But I think that's why though. I rocks with it. Nah, I, you can. But I feel like that's why it's not I'll higher. You know what I'm like, saying? Like for it to be higher, what would you expect them to do? More like calm stuff. Basically, what you're saying. I mean, like I'm a fine one. <laughs> Because, <laughs> like, the I stuff really we wear, it's like calm stuff. Like, you'll say Chinatown Market. Right. And they have, like, some basketball. It's cool. Or, like, the one with you said, this is Monty Faye's basketball. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's calm. But that's sometimes, like sometimes, like, I seen, like, a pair of like shorts. Like it'd be too much. Chinatown. Nah, it'd be too much. And I feel no, like that's why it's not up, up there. there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let me see. Yeah, what, yeah. What's another step on brand? Erica White, that's the uh, that's the brand, that's uh, the shoe that looks like the Jordan 1. Mm -hmm. But it's so swoosh, you got a lightning on it. Oh, yeah. I like those. Though. I like those. We talked about it in the yeah, episode. Yeah. But that's a really slept up brand. And he, he doesn't only make the shoe, he made hoodies. He uh, like he customized stuff like uh he did some Carhartt uh vest the other day mm -hmm. and he like he uh screen printed them. He screen printed like uh, black light models and all that stuff. Oh, mm -hmm. Like he's very black uh community positive. It's a black dude from New York, I think it is from New Jersey, I don't really remember. Yeah. That's cool. But he he really rocks with with the people more than anything. Yeah, yeah, of course. That's how it should be. That's, I hate it because people don't talk about him enough. Like they don't give him his credit. Yeah, I'm a, I'm gonna keep it local. I'm gonna keep it local. The big expensive brand. Yes, like, sir. It's it's it's, yes, it's, it's mad it's mad it's calm. calm. And you know you know that's fam or whatever. But the what? It's the big expensive brand. Yeah. See, he don't even know about it. Look at that. It needed to be higher up on the list. Honestly, I didn't know I didn't know what it was. So Chris put me on. Yeah. Like in the hoodie, the red hoodie with the blue. Go ahead, put me on. Yeah, I'm gonna put you on. Yeah, I'm, you on. I'm sorry, I'm giving you outfit away. But he had a light dinner so with the fearless and man, I was like, what? What kind of hoodie that is? And there was another day that we were hooping and he had the shirt off. I was like, what brand is that? Yeah. So he sent it my way and. You gotta man, right. check, check him out for real. For real. It's logo, you know what I'm saying? It's logo, it's logo. You, 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 and, you know, 15 days wait. Exactly. Days. Another thing is the clothes will sell out fast. They will sell out and, fast. And, and that's my thing. Like, I feel like if it's selling out locally, somebody else got to know about it. Man, that's why, that's why I said it, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Definitely. So, that's that's one in my opinion. I mean, I don't know how many pieces they make. They not making five shirts out of one. Right. I'm talking about they making a, a good amount. And they're they're, they're gone. selling out they're real gone. fast. They are gone. What's I remember for him. Sorry, for him they have to put the pieces to the side. Yeah. 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 They have to do that because it's gone. It's gone. <laughs> no care. Go ahead. I'm trying to figure out what's another brand that you slept on. A lot of brands I slept on. Probably brands that we haven't heard of yet. Well, really? Yeah, what, 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 we get, what, what, like, I know for a fact, when we get put on to those brands, we'll be like, hold on, why didn't I just know, like, why didn't I exactly. get put on sooner? Do you know what's another brand that they're slept on? The FDA brand. They knew the yeah. Oh, yeah. They so slept on those And then they get on the wave. It's oh, cooking oh, up. Oh, oh, it's cooking up. It's cooking up. Oh, it's on fire now, little bit. Oh, I think it's high. We got FTS called on the way, you know, just. Yeah, we got some, we got some yeah. coming. The last can be done this week because uh, some machines were down there something. But yeah, we and Virgil, Virgil couldn't get out here to get with yeah, us. Yeah, yeah uh, he was out there to sign up the 04745 Yeah, but I, I, I talked to uh, Jerry Lorenzo. Uh, okay. He said, oh, you, hmm. oh, you with Adidas now? No. Oh, I forgot. No, no, no he, he texted me first. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I said, oh, I, said, I, said I said, look, bro, hmm. these big chicks are up on my side. Oh, and what he said? He said, he said, he said a box. 
He said, okay. He wanted to smoke. He said, I'll be outside if I... <laughs> he wanted to smoke. <laughs> nah, What's some other things you guys want to talk about? Like, that's not including the slept on brands. Like, other things that are slept on, like beds. <laughs> All right, that wraps up episode <laughs> three, bro. This man is wild. Okay. So, one thing that's like not really slept on, but like couches, couches are also slept on. <laughs> so I'm slept on. So I'm slept on. Go ahead. So, like, so honestly, Mark. One thing that's like it's not really slept on, but like I want to say like it's underrated. Mm-hmm. Thrifty. Yeah. You can find grills thrifting, and like you can find really good um, pants. Is that, is that a thrift to show you that? Yeah, it's thrifted. It's oh, thrifted. wow. Yeah, peep my man in thrift. You can't oh, see wow. it. Shout out to the MacBook. But yeah. Uh, yeah. So but not like <laughs> thrift stores and Walmart. Walmart has nice clothes. I bought two pair of cargos from Walmart. Yeah, I seen, I seen them on TikTok that. Um, I might get a pressure with that. Like, where are you cargo from? Yeah. Walmart. And honestly, I feel like. I don't know. I haven't tried them on, but I feel like these gonna be too wide for my. Yeah, they yeah. will. They will be. So there you go. You try them on, but that's why I, like that's why I haven't tried them. Yeah, I like them though. But, but like, actually, I'll, I'll get them. Don't worry yeah. about it. Yeah, y'all, y'all boys put me on thrifting. I still ain't done it yet, but yeah, y'all put me on. No, yeah, we, put them on, we put them on where we go thrifting and we get hell and stuff. Yeah, that, that, yeah. that's the thrift that's how it works. I'm plugged in. Yeah, me and the plug we're best friends. Yeah, okay. <laughs> for real, for real. <laughs> Moving to a little more on the sneaker side, what's the most you would pay for a sneaker? We're gonna get on to like clothing next or like for hats, but like what's the most you pay for a sneaker? Ten bands. Ten bands. I said rubber bands. Oh, ten bands. I said rubber bands. Like you put the money on my mama. You probably get that from a restaurant though, huh? Ten bands. What's the most you would pay for a shoe? Uh, Well, that you already have paid for a shoe. That I already paid for a shoe. I think I paid seven for the Dior ones, but seven dollars. Seven, seven bands. But like I was plugged in, like I knew, bro. Now you know what I'm talking about. So (laughs) yeah, bro. So don't say those things. Don't say those things. I'm plugged in. I'm plugged in. I'm plugged in. I'm plugged in. So I pay. I pay about seven. 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 You know. And then I was just posted up like Bernie when I bought them. Oh. Oh, for real. <laughs> yeah. yeah you that for real. Nah, but on the real though, I think I say. I don't know, bro. That's tough. It depends on the shoe. Yeah, it depends on the shoe and how I feel about it. But I'm I'm gonna just keep it. I'm gonna just keep it light and say like five, five k, five six k. Okay. okay. Five hundred thousand. Nigga. Oh. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> nah, I'll pay like I'll pay like maybe a band. Band. Yeah. yeah. A band. Maybe two. Maybe two. Fifteen. Fifteen hundred. Definitely. Not definitely, but I'm saying like yeah. no boy. Oh bro, he having it for real. That's what that means. He having it for real. That's what it means. Nah, that's not what definitely means. Well, I'll, uh, I'll a band, a band at minimum. Fifteen. I'll, I'll, pay, I'll pay fifteen, almost two k, depending on the shoe. That's not fifteen. No, I'm talking about like a thousand five hundred or two thousand. You I know what you mean, but okay, okay, that's where you at from from fifteen hundred to yeah to two hundred. That's a that's your little range. That's okay. okay. It's for sneakers. Yeah, well, my, my range, wild. a band to sell. Yeah, a band to sell. A band, a band to sell thousand. Okay, okay. Use about. What about the clothing wise though? I'm doing good. I'm not paying no no five hundred dollars. I'm not gonna no. look. I will not pay. But that's a thousand dollars for a Dior shirt just to be go unnoticed. Mm. I mean, I'm just saying though. Mm-hmm. If you're paying, here's a, here's a, here's what I think. Mm. Clothes. Are more are judged more than shoes. Yeah. Cause like if you wear the, if I wear this hoodie three times and you see me wear it three times, you're gonna remember that I wore this hoodie three you times. The same more than I wore yeah. the, the shoes. <laughs> no, for real. Yeah. That's that's what I'm saying. So I feel like instead of paying eight hundred dollars for a shirt, you, I'm like, you shopping pieces and mix and match. Yes, but I'm exactly. saying with the eight hundred dollars. Yeah. But that's what you can get a nice real shoe with that and rock twenty seven thousand dollars. But since we're talking about clothes, I feel like if you buy an 800 shirt, you can only rock it once. Not really just once. But like, you have to like wear it one week, but, and then like three weeks later. Yeah, like you can't just rock it all the time. You definitely gotta space it out. You definitely gotta space it out. And like, if you wanna flex on the gram or flex in your friends on the Facebook or whatever you have to do, yeah. you can post that shirt every weekend. Exactly. 
Yeah. What about jeans though? I feel like you can wear the same jeans. Yeah, no, no, no. Yeah, waist down. It's just that top that. Yeah. I feel like tops and hats are more like. Oh, he's wearing the same thing again. True. Yeah. Type of uh, thing. But that's what I'm saying though. So I, I'm more on this nigga side on that when it comes to big spinning. Big, yeah. big, 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 uh, tickle, big, big, whatever. Oh, yeah, whatever. Yeah, whatever. Yeah, 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 yeah,